welcome to Let's Play Paper Mario! I am Lucas13 and you are seeing the glitchiest town in the game! Yeah, sadly that's still a factor here, but hopefully you can ignore it as I have learned to and we can get past this city real quick. <sighs> yeah, okay. Yeah, okay, maybe not ignore. Blown up into the sky, no castle horrors, only a hole remains. The beloved castle, where is it? Spread the word, outrage! Whoa, don't do that. Mm, it hurts my brain. I'm going to my house, fuck this shit. I'm just sitting here being a douche. Do 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 do. Hey, it's my douche brother, Luigi. Mario, what are you doing, you son of a bitch? Oh, I'm not doing much, you asshole. What's going on? Uh, you can tell they're brothers because of how they talk. I ran outside just as earthquake started. I managed to escape in time. Hey, what you looking at, bro? Oh. And who are you? I guess you're another one of those motherfuckers who's gonna go with my brother when I should be going with him, right? Yeah? Okay. okay. Uh, I'm Gubario. Nice to meet you. Just not nice to meet anybody! See, great. Just great. You're an exciting adventure with Mario. Whatever. I see someone has to look for this house. Fine. Brother, you're a douche. And I hate you. Oh, it's okay, my brother. It's very, you, you. Very, very. Uh, mutual, trust me. Yeah, you go ahead and do that. Wait, what? I don't even think there's anything here. Mario's house is surprisingly boring. It's on an island in the middle of nowhere, though, so that's nice. No, go away, leg. Okay. Salutations, you are Mario, are you not? Of course you are, no, you are. I'm the wisest toad rust. To de de <sighs> right. eh. Why you hate me, game? No! I must take it all! Okay. Nah. You know what? This is getting a little bit annoying. So, I may just skip certain segments. Yeah, I'm probably gonna have to do that. Real quick, though. Let's go in slow motion. Right. If I do anything important, I'll let you know. Until then, see you in a bit. Yeah, I figured I could show you this part, at least. <clears throat> Talking Turtle Man with a very weird ghost guy right behind him. It's the Dojo. Apparently, they train there. Master will be returning in soon, so be prepared. Master's wandering the world to purify his mind and train his body. Master was a strong man. He's coming back. He's a very, very strong man. We'll wait here, right here, until our master returns. Waiting is part of our training. You remind me of something, but I'm too lazy to remember. Some strangely colored toads that are actually black. What do we have here? A little bit of racial variety? Hmm? No? Oh, it's dangerous to go out there. I wouldn't go. Yeah, you shouldn't go. Nope, no go. Sorry, but no. Okay. So, they're gangsters. And they're assholes. Died. Yeah. Okay. Yeah! Screw you! Just making a joke. Okay, be right. Oh, look at this. Apparently, we got some mail from the blue, the red and blue Goomba. Goombario. You are not stronger than you look. We figured you were just some punk Goomba hanging around with Mario. Anyway, you proved yourself to us. And we've showed 
and you showed us that being good is as important as being strong. So, when you come back, do you think you could maybe be friends? Please say yes! We'll be waiting. I don't think I need to say much about that, yeah? Yeah, okay. Again, for the lag hits, say in a bit. Merlin is out! Oh, okay, what's going on, man? I said Merlin is out, so he must be out. I'm telling you, Merlin is out! Out! Well, I just want to make sure I'm telling you, Merlin is out! Get the fuck off my lawn! Yeah. Don't worry, we're almost there. Almost there, folks. Come on, you can stay with me. Yeah, there we go. I was in the castle when it started to shake, but my lightning quick feet got me out. I know Luigi made it out along with a few others, but everyone else was taken. Oh yeah, this place is awesome. I love, I love the shooting star summit. There's like stars all over the fucking place. Especially about this girl. Aha, uh -huh, my my, hello there, Mario. This spy's a little tight for fortune telling. You want to fortune read? You can talk to me on the counter. My lovely, my lovely, my <laughs> stunning fortune teller. My noble calling is to read fortunes while looking absolutely ravishing. I can help you find what you seek. My twinkle star here will show me all that is hidden. Tell me, shall I read your fortune? No, I'm okay, bitch! Uh oh. Uh oh, are you sure? If you seek anything, please call it on. Yeah, whatever, bitch. Hello, little Merle. I'm the famous Merlo, shooting star summon. I collect star pieces. I have a big collection. The star pieces are swapping for badges. No, I'm good. Whee! Yeah. This is over here. I think Kumbaria is like closing doors behind me. Always closing the door. No, why must this be hard? Okay. Yes, we were about to run into some huge, thick, pl throbbing plot. So, I hope you guys are ready for that. Nah, hopefully it won't lag like that. But yeah. And come on, get up there, get up there, get up there. Seven star spirits. Our job is to grant the wishes of good people from our home and star heaven a place high above the sky. We're going to tell you something incredibly important. Please listen carefully. The other day, Bowser and his followers invaded our peaceful star heaven. They stole our prized treasure, the star rod, which we cared for since the beginning of time. Star rod. Powerful beyond belief, they can grant any wish. For as long as we can remember, Bowser has been making wishes like, for instance, I'd like to trounce Mario, or I want Princess Peach to like me. Of course, 
stars ignored such selfish wishes. So I thought his wishes were never granted. Bowser, that fiend. When he found out that we were ignoring his wishes, he came and stole the star rod so he could grant his own wishes. He seemed content right now, mainly because he defeated you and captured the princess. Seven star spares to keep the star rod safe and use it properly. We must get the star rod back from Bowser and return it to its rightful place. In order to do this, Mario, we need your help. Sadly, right now you are not strong enough to challenge Bowser. He has made himself all powerful by wishing, wish, making wishes with the star rod. He is terrible to behold. Seven star spirits are reunited in star heaven. We can give you the power to fight Bowser even with his newfound strength. With our help, you can prevail. Mario, we are... Alas, we have nearly exhausted our power to talk to you. Though it looks like we are beside you, it is only an illusion. We are using all of our strength to communicate with you over a great distance. Even now, our strength Wild Bowser's followers in different part places throughout the Mushroom Kingdom. Please, Mario, first of all, you must rescue us. In order to take back the Star Rod back from Bowser and save Princess Peach, we need your help. Please, Mario, you are our last hope. So, even though Bowser could have wished Mario dead and the Princess Peach in love with him, he did neither because he's retarded. That's, that's lovely. I have no words for the stupidity, you know. Oh look, the crying bitch tits. I mean, wait, what part is hurt? Yeah, he's alright. <coughs> Something must be done if only someone can help. I wonder who can help? Oh shit, not you. <laughs> 